It's Jerry Ratcliffe reporting from the Greensboro Coliseum just moments after ACC Commissioner John Swafford broke the official news that this year's ACC tournament, or what's left of it, has been canceled due to the risks of coronavirus. Uh, ACC followed suit shortly after the SEC, AAC, and I think Big Ten uh, called off their tournaments. Uh, it has been an uh, ongoing fluid situation since this morning when Swafford had a press conference. He had been on a, a teleconference with commissioners of the other Power Five conferences discussing whether these, the events should go forward. Uh, some of the tournaments between that time and UVA's, uh, or excuse me, the ACC's uh, scheduled first game today uh, changed everything with the other tournaments calling off their events. Swafford uh, shortly afterward followed suit and um, Florida State and Clemson were out, already out on the floor warming up and both teams were called off the floor, which was a definite sign that something was happening. Moments later, Swafford came out and broke the news that, um, that this year's event was canceled. He saluted Florida State and Clemson for being out on the floor and wanting to play and uh, also uh, declared Florida State, who won the regular season title, as official uh, ACC champions if there is an NCAA tournament next week. Um, I guess everything else is uh, just uh, self-explanatory uh, with the, uh, everything going rapidly wild in the sports world and the rest of the world. Uh, so uh, it looks like this year's 2020 ACC tournament is done. Uh, None of the quarterfinal games were actually played. And uh, just stay tuned for other news. Uh, I guess the next step is whether the NCAA tournament will decide whether to call its event off or to try to play through with no fans as it originally announced. Signing off from Greensboro, we'll have more on, ACE, on the, the ACC and everything else. Uh, today at jerryrackliff.com. I'm going to go to work on the stories right now. Thanks for tuning in.